Yo, what's good? YouTube Maniac here, here live streaming. Everyone has questions about the dead zones. We're just going to make a quick video re real quick explaining some stuff. Acceleration, horizontal, and vertical look sensitivity. It's all, that's all just like, that's really just on you. I would, I would recommend, especially if you're a noob, I would recommend putting your vertical sense uh, up one or like maybe one and a half or two above your horizontal. So like if you want to play five cents, do like five, seven. Right now I'm on five Excel, five and a half horizontal, seven vertical. More importantly, the dead zones. I would say this is a good place to start. Move thumbstick, put that on zero. Max input threshold, put that on, uh, keep that on 10. Axial dead zone, you're just going to adjust this as low as you can get it without drifting. Like when I put my axial dead zone for my move, which is like moving left and right, I drift. So I, I, mine's on five right now and it's all right. Same thing for look thumbstick. Uh, center dead zone, put it at zero, max input threshold, keep it at 10. Same thing with axial dead zone, make it as low as it can go without getting drift. Drift is when your fucking controller is moving by itself. If you're getting drift, put it up a little bit. Uh, mine's on three right now. I barely, barely kind of sort of get drift, but not really. Uh, like if I put it to two, I start drifting and it's obvious. If I put it to three, it's about as... Look, Mom, it's about sorry. as quick as I can get it without it drifting. So mine's on three. So there you go, man. Make your shit zero, ten, and then make this as low as your controller can go. Make this zero, ten, then make this as low as your can controller, your controller can go. All right, maniac out. Peace. <laughs>